Hey guys, Major Gamer here. Um, so I'm gonna do a reaction video to the Black Ops 3 Ember teaser trailer. And so yeah. some sort of super soldier program is not just untrue, it's patently absurd. Next question. Neural control. Voluntary limb replacement. This is happening. The only question that remains is how far will we allow it to go? Okay, so, yeah, so clearly it's going to take place in 2065. I mean, I'm, I want to get it, like, because Black Ops is my favorite series. Um, hopefully it's good. And hopefully we, hopefully, uh, in the multiplayer we get, like, the bionic arms and limbs and stuff. Because that would be awesome. And, um, you know, I'm getting really absolutely tired of all these future games since, uh, Black Ops 2 has come out. It's just been all future games and it's really annoying. Because, like, I really want to go back to World War 2 or just past wars because it's getting really annoying with the future. Because, um... If, if terrorists don't come into the U.S. on 2025, um, terrorists have, don't have, uh, a, something and send, like, missiles into the U.S. Uh, if we don't get exosuits and all this, all this stuff in advanced warfare in 2051, 2061 and we don't go into a civil war and then like 2065 well it's like and all, well, all the stuff it was talking about with the dates like if that doesn't happen then Call of Duty what the heck because I doubt that would be that much advanced 
in technology when because when I'm 65 and I see nothing happen like I'm just gonna be like really because like Halo like that's like 2500 so they get a, an excuse but Call of Duty just has been taking it too far I wish they would just go back to the past like classic Call of Duty's so, I can't wait for Black Ops 3 though. Uh, definitely, I'll be doing a walkthrough of the campaign when I get it. So, like this video, subscribe, and see you.